Hey everybody, it's Supersonic, and uh, today I'm going to show you how to make your Windows Vista look like uh, Windows 7. So uh, first, what you want to do is um, open up your web browser, which you probably are already in since you're watching this video. Then you want to go to Vista Glass Place, download dot com or whatever so and I'll give you a link in the description you want to click download now and save file and then uh, once it's done downloading you want to run the setup and then uh, open it up And you should see this here. Um, these are checkmarked because I already patched it. You want to, uh, if it's not checkmarked, you want to go in there and then do patch, which should be right here. But I already did, so yeah. And once you're done with that, it should ask you to patch all. You want you're gonna want to patch it all. Then you'll have to uh, uh, restart. And then, uh, once you're done restarting, you want to go to the Windows 7 theme website. And, uh, this download link does not work. It just shows a picture. See. Um... Uh, but you want to click download from here, here, the click here, and then free user. But then you want to wait. Then you want to click download. And just open it. And this takes a couple minutes. So I won't download it. Just open up. You'll see in your uh, RAR, your uh, WinRAR, or whatever program you use, this thing here. You're going to need one, so it's not going to work without one. So then you just want to double click win7.exe. Then, yeah, just run the setup. And make sure it says in the destination folder right here uh... C windows resources themes make sure it's in there also won't work once it's done installing what you want to do uh, oops is x of uh, this x of uh, this right click on the desktop go to personalize then you want to do click theme and go down to there will be a bunch of Windows 7 dash uh, resolutions I'm going to pick yours and uh, if you don't really know just uh, keep on going through them until you see the one that's full screen so I already found mine and saved it you, you, you're going to want to save it so you don't have to uh, go through every time if you forget and then you want to click apply
And then this changes right here. That's pretty cool. Um, and the taskbar changes and your background changes. You may also find the fish somewhere online. If you do, send me a message, alright? Uh, so, but this, the taskbar doesn't completely look like Windows 7. Uh, because the icons are too small. What you want to do then is right click on there and, uh, click lock the taskbar, uncheck it. And these will be, these will come up and you'll be able to move it if you really want to go back okay and uh... when there's the uh... shortcut you want to right click in an empty space and go up to view and then large icons and then there'll be large you want to open it up so you can see them all Oops, there's still one more. And then, uh, it'll look like Windows 7. Uh, that's really cool. Um, and then there's also, uh, some features like arrow shake, arrow snap, and arrow peak that uh, are in Windows 7 <coughs> that you don't have in Vista, but you can get